What? We're coming! Just call that! What's happening to her? Oh, come on! No, it's closing! What happened? Ah, here we go. Hey everyone, it's your friend Think Noodles, and welcome back to Poppy Playtime Chapter 3. And yes, I say back and I mean it. Do not watch this video if you haven't watched my playthrough first. The game is amazing, and I'm going to break it in this video. So go watch it as it is intended to be played, and then come back here and watch me destroy the game. No, I, I mean, I'm not really going to destroy the game, but in my first playthrough, I did miss a couple of things. I'm just going to go ahead and skip this, but I didn't do this in the other one. Uh, we probably will skip all of the tapes. You're going to lose out on a lot of lore if you don't watch it uh, and experience it for the first time uh, as a direct regular playthrough without, um, like, you know, pauses and fly hacks and things like that. Because that's what we're here for today. We'll, we'll let, uh, actually, I want to see. Will this, uh... Well, let, let, let's not mess it up because I might actually just mess up the entire game if I do this during a cutscene. But I just want to make sure that I've got everything installed properly. So if I do, uh, but nope, that's not it. Oh yeah, look. Okay, there's 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 a the camera. Okay, now yeah, game paused. Now once we get to a spot where we're like kind of safe, uh, we'll pause it, make sure that I can get. Because there's one other thing I wanted to see is if I can um, like add these like these point light sources here. All right, well let's see. Control Shift P. Oh, okay. Yep, you can. Uh, whoa. Okay, <laughs> that worked. Uh, let's turn the. Key. Let's see if we can. Yeah. So I can add light so that we, if we really want to see something close, I can just go and put it there. All right, and then there's one more thing. So I think if I go like this, then I like move. Yeah, there it is. Okay, so. I move the mouse uh, like this. Yep. Okay. Yeah. And I can actually go through walls now, right? So if I go like this. Yep. Okay. Cool. So we can actually. Yeah. We can actually go through stuff here like this. Yeah. And explore. Okay. So I think I've got it. <laughs> think I know what we got to do. Now, uh, we're going to try one more th thing here. And that is. Okay. So what we're going to do is I'm going to. Well. So the NPCs are paused, but I'm moving, so I th Oh, I thought I did the parkour too. I'm like, oh yeah, let's go. But no, we actually have to do the parkour. But it's not that hard. But theoretically, Catnap is frozen in place. And nope, he's not. But we're gonna pause the game and we're gonna go look at him. Let's move in right here. Here we go. Oh, we're in his body now, and there's his head. And let's see if they actually rendered his head. They did! Would you look at that? Now, they didn't actually need to because we don't actually even see his head. Uh, but they did complete him. So we can go right into his mouth here. And I would love to... I wonder if it's possible to have the camera here but have him move. So if I, if I resume the NPC... Look, we can. So I'm sort of resuming him, but he's, it's paused. So he's not actually, like, I can't, if I, well, I take it back. I think if we go like this, okay, what's he going to do when he hits this fan? So we want to see what he does when he hits the fan. We also want to look at him. I think I can actually make it play. Let's see. There. And he gets his head chopped off by the fan. Well, that's not very exciting now, is it? So now we can pull this back. And that was our first view of what we can do with this tool. Oh, now, is this... See, this is another spot that I actually want to try here. Let's just... Let's go forward a little... No, that's not forward. This this is forward. Okay, let's just have a look at... Okay, so there was a fan here. And then through here... Oh, this continues. Let's... Well, I think it might end here. So, control shift p Yeah, so that's where it all ends right here. Whoa, what's all that? This is like outside the what? What is that? What? I don't, I don't have we ever seen this? Oh, okay, yeah, this is the track that we go on for um for Elliot's ride. Again, spoilers, if you guys haven't watched it, go watch the first one, please. Uh what's through here? Oh, this is where the train is and we can actually like well, we're a little early, but hey, you know what? Why not? See, it says work area. Where's the like play care sign that was in chapter two? 
at the end. Oh, here we are. This is inside. Here we go. Yeah, I mean, this is this is pretty darn close, you guys. I don't know what that is. I guess it's part of the crash. But yeah, it is pretty darn close to how we crashed in Chapter 2. Okay, back into my hands. <laughs> Let's drop down and do what we're supposed to do here. Oh, oh, man. Now, we don't need to bother with the VHS tapes because we've already seen all of them. Uh, we didn't miss any. And I didn't even realize <laughs> until just now this is... Where Catnap dropped us. How did I not realize that? And I, I just have to do this, guys, because I'm me. And you guys know how I am about my toilets. I just need to see. Are there any toilets in here? Oh, yeah, there, no, there's no there's no toilets in here. Ah, I'm a little disappointed now. Uh, right. <laughs> well, they didn't have to finish that part of the bathroom because we technically don't see it. But there you go. There's an elevator here. Hold on, Gregory. I'm going to actually pause so he shuts up. Oh, no, it still just keeps ringing. Okay, well, whatever. I just want to go right through here. Yeah, there's nothing on that. See, that's <laughs> this is the back of the elevator. There's absolutely nothing here. You can see my hands back there. Oh, yeah, I recognize it now. <laughs> now it makes sense. So this is, you know what? Yeah, let's do this. So we got a little bit further here. So this is before we go into the, the Sky Dome. Now, his thing is going to keep running because the game doesn't understand that we're outside of this. Uh, and actually, I don't think that the the car is... Yeah, so the car is stuck. Um, but what we can do is we can go up and we can actually, like, oh, explore the cave outside the Sky Dome just to, like, see what's here. I mean, it's very extremely detailed. Uh, considering it's something you only see for a second outside and it looks like is it no it's floating in the air I was gonna say it looks like well from the back it's floating in the air but from this side here it is inside a cave and it is like embedded into it now if I go through the top is it gonna actually load properly oh look at this this is something you would never see either. Like inside the Sky Dome, and I didn't even notice there was this giant fan here. Uh, let's go a little further. And this is before we arrive and before the lights come on. But yeah, the whole thing is fully loaded. All right, let's get back in. Let's get it removed. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, see here, it looks like it's embedded into the mountain, which I mean, for the camera's perspective, it absolutely is. I mean, this is the kind of stuff that Disney does, like where you can see like a mountain off in the distance and it looks perspectively like an actual mountain off in the distance, but behind it, it's, it's empty, you know, cause you don't need to see that side. If I, yeah, I'll just let that keep running now cause we don't care. Uh, let's see. So I'm wondering too, like, so uh, this, it, it, we, we go to all of these places. We visit all of these places during the uh, during the game and like for example this right home sweet home like what is it like in oh wow it re so you know when well hold on so yeah you go down these stairs right and this is where it loads right when you're playing the game it changes the loading sequence but interesting uh, let's see now what okay yeah 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 so that's where it loads uh, because that doesn't actually exist in the house uh, it teleports you to another area where a new map loads because yeah through here you're actually like underneath the ground <laughs> underneath the house because you went under uh, it could theoretically be there but I think it'd probably be a lot of RAM and whatnot so they don't do it wait did we ever go into the toy shop I don't think we do we never go into the toy shop right ha <laughs> ha here we go this is where the front door would be right here right where pretty much level with the front of it yeah so let's see what was it what is in the toy store if anything at all um I can't see so we're just gonna put a light there's brick this is the inside of the toy store or toy shop or whatever it is for these poor orphans you guys gave them nothing it was all for show this is oh wait what's over uh this is outside no this is actually inside let's see or it would be inside no actually I think this is visitable Let's see. Oh, no, that's, yeah, that is through the wall there. So, again, another empty room. And then I think there's one on this side then, too. 
Yeah, this is not visible from the outside. Yep, it is completely empty. Uh, much like most of these buildings. Uh, yeah, they are <laughs> empty inside. Uh, but at least these ones, like, load into something, right? That one exists for nothing. What, can we... Could we ever get in this water? I didn't. I didn't actually try. Wait, let we're, we're, we're we can play now. Oh, 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 oh don't die! <laughs> I don't know why it dropped me from there, but sure. Am I supposed to be up here? <laughs> what? Oh, there. What? Hold on. What? Was I supposed to go down a? This, oh, I think I was supposed to get down that slide, right? Uh, I don't remember now. But we can pretend I'm going down the slide. No, I don't think we do. Let's see where this leads anyway. Okay, just to right. Maybe. Oh no. Uh oh. Uh oh. I think I made a boo-boo. Just go under the statue. I'm working on it, Ollie. I'm a little bit busy. I'm stuck, bro. I can give Let's you a go. key down there. Thank you. Can I have the key, please? Ba bum. Gimme. Send it to the vacuum tube, bro. Now where does that go? I feel like that doesn't go anywhere. But worth a look you know so let's get underneath it and let's go straight wait uh, which way is up <laughs> oh no I'm disoriented hold on let's back up a little bit here we go yeah okay now we're right in the center of it and we're gonna go straight up the pipe and it goes to absolutely nowhere as I expected straight out of the ground okay all right and yeah this is a huge area and uh, while he talks we're gonna I'm gonna fly around. All that gas you see Let's see. Mm. Right here in the so, okay, there's a door here. And right now, it, <laughs> this is like I was saying with Dizzy, right you see this, and then you go to the back, and then it's like, it's just, it's just nothing, right? That's how we can get to him. Yeah, there's, the it's pretty hollow. Oh, there's a room here, but I think this is, ah, okay, this is that parkour room. Uh, when we first start learning about how to use the hand. Oh yeah, we can get in here. This is all loaded. This is also learning. Um, what if we go down here? Does it? Oh no. Yeah, because of the loading thing, right? Obviously. All right. Give me key. Give me key. Give me key. So, home sweet home is the huggy wuggy or nightmare huggy wuggy chase. Now again, I am going to ruin the cinematic aspect of this. I hope you're not looking for the full experience like uh, like it should be. Now the other thing too, we want, I, I did miss a uh, catnap in event somewhere supposedly. So we do want to watch for that. And also when we do see catnap, we can light him up. We can um, like literally with a light, not like shoot him. All right, so now we're entering this it's the red smoke and it makes us all dreamy and weird and crazy. Let's get through it a little. Well, we want to like, do we want to add some lights? Yeah, let's add some lights just to like, just to get a better look at it uh, without the red glow. Just to see if there's anything interesting in here. I'm not, I'm not expecting a lot, but it does help with the redness. Uh, we got mommy long legs. They're all just toys and cat bees and little poppy fireplace and we can actually see oh you know what I want to see hold on I just want to jump out real quick because I want to see since we're in this yeah so we're in this level here and this is the home sweet home oh my goodness look at this so this is the entire home sweet home layout uh, I was just seeing if any of the uh, the main sky dome would be working but it isn't um, yeah dude can we like Oh, what is this right here? What's this like? What is that? <gasps> Yo, look. Yo. Yo, what is he doing? Like, he's in the hallway already. Let's put another light on him. Like, because he, he looks a little, he, he does look scary like that. But let's put another, like, point light here. And here. Yo, look at that. That's cool. So, actually, we can find all of his, like, appearances. Or we should be able to just based on the light, right? I think it's going to like, uh, oh, I hear something over here. I've also heard that like one of the radio things is actually someone speaking back. Like it's, it's backwards. Oh, look, here we go. Here we go. Right here. Uh, you guys remember uh, in my playthrough that I, uh, I spotted him right through this door here. Like you could see him there uh, when you're when you're playing. But 
Now we can go inside and see if he's a full body or not. He is. Yeah, tail and everything, right? Oh, and I didn't, like, I didn't realize how skinny he was until we saw him later on in the game. You can see all the stitches uh, of his costume, which to me means, like, it's a costume. And, oh, yeah, and you see the zipper? That's what I was wondering, too. Like, who's in there? There's an actual, like, midline zipper on him. That it's like a suit that someone is wearing. Like, what's underneath? Can we see? Uh, no. We're inside his body, and, <laughs> and it's empty. Okay, the, I know the ringing is getting annoying. It's getting annoying for me, too. The great thing about editing is, I, well, we can shut it off for you, and I just have to suffer. Oh, look, he's actually moving. Look. I didn't notice that. Is this the same one that I lit up? Yeah, this is where the... But look, watch his face. He's actually like... Okay, now you're gonna make me a liar, bro. <laughs> he was like, he was move. Oh, that's what it is. He turns his head based on where you are. He looks at you. I don't I don't think the Huggy Chase is loaded. I don't see the Huggy Chase room. I don't think it's loaded here yet. Uh, oh, wait, what's, oh yeah, this is, yeah, so this, oh, here's the room, here's the room. So, I mean, I don't know, can I trigger it? No, the player has to start the TV going. Okay, now there he, there he is, look, look, look. He ain't so scary anymore, is he? Oh, look at him go backwards. Oh, and look at that. So that's what that's what blocks you from seeing him anymore. This like this wall. There was a a direction that I wanted to go. You didn't get me this time, dude. That scared me so much last time. Oh, 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 pause. Now I think this is the one we saw before that um that was wandering. Um that we put the point light source on and we didn't encounter. Yeah, this looks like him. Let's see. Because if I move, let's see, if I move this way, is he, is he, nah, he's not following me, hmm, okay. <laughs> That's scary, actually, even with that lighting, um, you know, you got, you're walking, to, oh, man, oh, but he just despawns like that, ah, oh, but you wouldn't see it, because it normally it would be dark, but the animation prior to that is so good. Yeah, I never, wait, this is the, yeah. This part is backwards. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna reverse it. Okay. Your presence was demanded 10 years ago and you didn't show up. 8-8-1995. You were supposed to be here. Why weren't you here? You, you missed, missed the event. The event. You, missed the meeting. you missed the meeting. You missed the party. You have no right to be here. I find your presence intrusive. After all this time, you return. After all this time, you return. Come in here and, Come in here kill, and, murder. and kill and murder? Your presence was demanded 10 years ago and you didn't show up. Eight, eight, so nine. someone wanted him in 1985, then he shows up in 1995, 8, 8, 1995. If you recall, it is, is the day of the hour of joy. Uh, if we go all the way back to when, okay, where, where am I going? I'm like, <laughs> Uh, yeah, here we go. When uh, Mob Games released a few like surveillance videos on their channel, those were dated 8 8 1995 when Kissy Missy was released uh, by Huggy Wuggy. That is when they escaped, and that is when they went after everyone. So, this, okay. So, I didn't miss anything. <laughs> I got really upset when I was doing my playthrough that I had actually missed this and there was something in here. So, was it planned? I mean, it says you come back, you're, who are they talking to? Who is talking? Any theories? Po post in the comments, I'm sure MadPat will pick it up, uh, I mean, well, or whoever is, uh, <laughs> whoever's doing, uh, well, by now, oh, 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 I gotta go look. I, I feel like he'll still be doing a game theory for this one, which I hope, uh, because he's still got a little bit more time left at game theory. Oh, this is kind of cool the way that it's lined up, too, because if I put a... Yeah, if I put a light, yeah, it looks like his claws made, or his, yeah, his claws made those scratch marks. Yeah, there he is. Does he, uh, does he watch me? Nah. And I think if I just, like, unpause it, 
He's just gonna like, oh, oh, he disappear. All right, so what I'm gonna do here is uh, I'm gonna try and pause NPCs and see if we can get really far ahead of Huggy. No matter what, he catches you. You cannot escape. Uh, that is part of the game. Uh, but let's see how far we can get a head start on him. Nope. Oh, but they stopped the door. All right, we'll see if we're able to pause him. Because which one is pause NPCs? It's this one, right? NPCs are now paused. It's actually twisting my view. If I go this way, it actually pulls your view to the TV. Like, I'm not doing that. If I look up, yeah, it's pulling you toward that so that you see, which is really smart because if you're like, like looking for stuff while you're listening, you're going to miss this right here, baby. Here we go. All right, let's see. Oh, wait, right. <laughs> I know it's coming. It's like uh, so much anticipation. Here it is. There it is. Okay, so not paused. Okay, I can pause him like that so we can like, we can go have a look inside his mouth. I mean, he looks like Huggy, minus the pause. That's the only part that really doesn't look like him. Uh, so we can actually like unpause him. Let's get away. Let's see if we how much of his body we can actually see. So we'll run a little bit here and then we'll pause it. It didn't pause. Okay, there. I'm like, what? It didn't pause. Okay, let's uh, let's let's. Uh, how do I spin with the camera? There we go. Yes. Oh my goodness. Look at this. The perfect thumbnail. <laughs> Well, actually, it just needs a little bit more light. You gotta like back it up here like this and then you do like that Maybe a little bit closer up here Boom. And then like that there we go And we can put my little animoji character like right right well I can't I can't put the mouse but like right running away You know the interesting thing. Oh, no, he it is blue I was gonna say he looks more like Killy Willy because of the darkness there. No, it's definitely huggy Yo, that's bright. <laughs> look at look at how long these teeth are and look at I mean look at the detail the inside of the mouth It's so dark you wouldn't even be able to see it But they went all out on this because they knew this would be one of the most popular scenes in the game Let's let's watch him run through us here because we can actually watch him run Without him killing us at the camera. Here we go. Yes Okay, And then he gets the player and then and then this happens. This is like, um, what is it? Like, uh, Garten of Ban Ban 3 when Ban Ban slaps us in the head. Uh, it's, it's like that. It, it advances the storyline. You cannot escape it. And yeah, I'm just realizing now that I've looked in here, this is the same room we start. Like, now that I've played it twice and look, like, really analyzed everything, like, I understand where we are. Now, people asked about this, and I'm not sure I put it in the playthrough because he doesn't do anything, but like, they're like, did anybody, did everyone miss Daddy Longlegs' thing? And yeah, he doesn't do anything. It just does static. Same with mommy. They both don't do anything. And, and you can hold this forever. It's kind of cool. Um, you know, I never actually. You know what? I never actually died to the. Okay, I just want to see what happens. <laughs> I never died to it. I always flipped on the mask at the last second. It doesn't really do anything special. I thought maybe that we would see catnap or something uh, cool, but no, it just puts us right back to the uh, spawn point there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And here's Kissy. I didn't. That's right. Yeah. Poor thing. Do we think that's Poppy? I feel like that might be Poppy, and that's why she's so partial to her. See, look. Right here. Everything but a toilet. I'm telling you. They got something against toilets. Ah, that was supposed to scare me. So that does fall off. I was like looking in the wrong direction. It didn't scare me this time because I figured it was going to come. But uh, yeah, let's go. <gasps> there, catnap in the vent. I saw it. I did. I saw it. Is he still? I don't know if he's actually still there. Let's just go look. I'm not even going to bother pausing, but let's just see if he's still here. What? How could he? Okay, I guess he was like right there. His face was huge. I, now I kind of am sad I missed it because I would like to see if it was his whole body or not. But I definitely saw it, guys. That is there, uh, which is connected to this. Uh, ah, yeah. Okay, okay, this room. Okay, I definitely saw it. <laughs> Didn't before, but I do, I do now. Oh. Oh, you can't pause it. <laughs> I can't. No. So this is just a cutscene. didn't do anything wrong. Uh huh. Here to help. Okay. Yeah. I mean, we get to explore this whole this thing anyway, so it's not tense. really like 
You can't. I'm glad explore. that Ollie could help you get and, this far. And see her closely. He's we can. We All right. So the school. Now, uh, this one is actually interesting because, uh, well, there's a few things. <laughs> one, they have changed the behavior of Miss Delight from when I played it and from uh, when uh, the early access YouTubers played it. Uh, they nerfed her, I think, rather significantly. Um, she was tough. But also, okay. there are. I think I can connect to you on that side of the dome. Yes, and Ollie. You won't be alone. Okay. Trying to talk here. Yeah, so there are actually six Easter eggs in this part. Uh, these are the only collectibles in the game. I missed every Isn't single one of them. <sighs> and I'm being interrupted. Yeah, literally being interrupted again. So yeah, uh, they're the only collectibles in the game. Uh, they further the lore. I missed them all. There are six. We're going to find them in the first one. Yep, it is right here. Yeah, so it's really hard to tell, like, what is collectible and what isn't. I mean, you would think this or whatever. Uh, but little pieces of paper like that are collectible. And that is note number one. And uh, it has to do with the Hour of Joy. And we can just do this. Just a few weeks ago, now is the Hour of Joy. Today, there's only silence in this school. I don't think any of us here know what to do with it. The hallways without the children carry even the smallest sounds as if they were shouts. The other teachers and I startle each other constantly. We'll have to get used to it. Something about the front door. There's something locked the front door this morning. We haven't been able to open it. So right there, that tells me uh, in, in note number one that uh, the hour of joy, only the kids were killed or maybe the parents, but the teachers were spared by the bigger bodies, by, uh, by Huggy Wuggy uh, and all of the other uh, animatronics. Now we, we want to keep looking. See, like that's not collectible. That's not collectible. Uh, we have to find all of these papers uh, before we trigger Miss Delight. Oh, there's another one. Okay, now it had blood on it. Okay, so see, man, I didn't even realize that it was uh, that it was. I, I've just been hitting every piece of paper I see. Uh, okay, let's have a look at this one. So this is note. Hopefully, I get these in. Oh, note number two. And yeah, so things got a little bit. L turned for the worse. Now there's blood on them. I heard a knock at the door today. The locked door, I assume. I heard it breathing. Whatever it was, it wouldn't speak when called out to. I spent hours after it went silent, wondering if this was what locked us in here. I've made a weapon of sorts. Pencils and rulers and tape and twine. I've taken to calling it Barb. It's crude, but if that door opens, I need to be ready. Okay, so now we know who the author of this is. Uh, th it's Miss Delight writing these. Which sort of makes sense, right? Like this is, uh, this is her dominion, um, and uh, she is, I guess, transitioning from nice teacher to uh, what she ends up turning into, and she's building that weapon. Oh, pause. Well, let's there. Let's get some light on her. There we go, and let's go have a look at Miss Delight. Now, is she fully formed here? There we go. Whoa, that's a little bright, but it works. It works. Ew. So, yeah, I mean, her jump scare is super accurate. I never really got a good look at her because uh, the jump scare is quick. And yes, I saw her jump scare a ton of times. But look at how detailed it is. Like, her eyeballs have all these scratches on it. Like, it, it, the, the hair, everything on this is incredibly detailed. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, she just <laughs> goes around the corner and despawns on us. Huh? Oh, that one is Bar? definitely. Ah, how did I? Okay, Bar? all right. I mean, I know how I missed it because there was just. I, I mean, I wasn't. I didn't know there were things we could pick up like this. Uh, note number three. No food for days. The others argue with me over what was left. They started glaring, judging. They blocked the kitchen door with their bodies. I think they've singled me out to die first. Oh, you ain't getting away so fast, lady. I'm coming for you. There she is. Uh, does she, is she carrying something? No, no. She's just, she's just, uh, strolling as one does on a bright summer day, right? Yeah, look at that. Bright summer day. Look at that. The sun's out. She's enjoying herself. Look at, oh, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> Whatever. Oh, dude, this one's so obvious. Now that I know what to look for, come on. They're all in order. Or maybe it just does that. Like, it gives you one. The pit in me howls for food. I can't think about anything other than how hungry I am. Hardly have the strength now to pick myself off the floor. 
Barb speaks to me, though. She gives me strength. I found that if I stand still completely still, everyone thinks I'm dead. Barb says I need to eat and I that the other teachers would never see me coming. Anything to stop the howling. So she's being driven by hunger to kill all the other teachers. I thought that he was just showing us which vent to go in, but no, he was actually showing us the paper. That's like, they're, they're, that's probably where they like, okay, they're gonna see this one and then they're gonna go back and look for the other ones. But no, I'm just completely oblivious. Oh, I'm coming in. Let's see what we got. You know, hey, there she is. I just, all she does is walk around. She, she doesn't do really anything else. We can just, there she goes and boop. That's Come right where she'd be spawned. Mm -hmm. You're not like the other humans in that way. I'm not really caring because I, I just... I dreams will sound like yeah, theirs yeah, yeah. too. I don't care. Mm. Ooh, we're getting close. Ooh, I haven't found them all yet. I think there's one after, so we're, we're missing one. I might have to go back. Oh, wait. Oh! <laughs> it's lit up! Ugh. Okay, we got it. Is that five? Yes, okay. Oh, oh, oh. I'm sorry. I had to eat. I had to survive. I ate them. I had to. 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 So that mo so she went from teachers who like I don't know what happened and it's weird with all the children not being here to I am eating other teachers now. <laughs> now we get to do this. Now I, I I know the route, although I like, I, what? Oh, I'm like what am I doing? Um. I, I remember the route. I just don't know what she's like now. I'd kind of like to see how she works now. Uh, okay, so you can... I don't know what her hitbox size is either. So this is what they've changed. When you look at her, she doesn't move. When I first played this, she never stopped moving. Looking at her or not, she was always chasing. If the lights went out, then she moved. And if the lights came on, then she stopped. But it didn't matter. Let's see. Ah, yep, okay. So that's how she works. She works. I mean, this is more like a this is like a gold rush. It's like a maybe. Is this not how weeping angels actually are? I think it is. But man, it's so much easier. Like you, you can just walk backwards through everything, and you don't even need to know the route. What happens here? Does she actually teleport? Oh, she, she she really teleported right through. Okay. So I mean, she's easier than she used to be. But as long as you keep an eye on her, you're good. Because this, this was so hard when I played it before. Like, you had to basically be perfect. All right, yeah, she's easier because you can just do that. And you can, like, <sighs> there was none of that. There was no breathing. There was not, okay, what do I do next? Let me just look at her and think about what I'm going to do next because I'm actually a little bit lost. <laughs> oh, this is nothing, dude. All right, I mean, she's still kind of a challenge, but not really. <laughs> um... Because you're able to stop her. Come in. Well, she's stuck outside the fence. Oh, is she coming in? Oh, now I feel. Wait, what? Oh, this is. A oh, okay. That is one thing she's able to do still, and was able to do when we played before, is the teleporting. Even though, like, I did not do this very well at all. Like, psh, no problem. And here she comes. Oh, she teleported in. She's still coming. Yep, we go here. Then just like chapter two, we pull the lever and BAM! All right, it's time. We need to take a look-see. Yep, I mean, she's partially in the ground, which you kind of expect when a garage door hits her in the face. Look at her hands all twisted up and stuff. But the full body is actually there. Uh, whereas, like, if you remember in uh, chapter two, when we, uh, when we took out Mommy Longlegs and, and, and the prototype came for her, and we'll see that when uh, the prototype comes for Catnat, we only saw, like, part of the hand, right? This is fully rendered. Now, oh wait, is this it? Oh, we got it. That's number six right there. That's all the notes, right? Yes, we got all the notes. This is all the lore on this level. Uh, the door opened today and I heard something enter my hall. Together, Barb and I found Catnap waiting all this time, all this agony. It was he who locked the door. I know it. I wanted to kill him, but knew better than to believe I could. He seemed oddly glad to see I was all that remained. We made a deal. We take care of each other now. Report what we see to the other and to him. So she means to each other, right? Like she's telling Catnap, Catnap's telling her, 
And they are also telling the prototype. Okay, time to fly. <laughs> yeah, so this is what this is perfectly designed for here is just to like get a look. I mean, it's not, there's actually not anything we couldn't see or experience or, or explore uh, than what we do. Yeah, there's nothing, oh, I'm a little bit disappointed there. Oh, yes, okay, here we go, here we go. All right, so pause, let's go. This is what we, this is cool. So, uh, yeah. Um, okay, so here's something interesting, because I had thought that, and he is smaller, but I would thought that the developer said that PJ Pugapillar was still alive, because we didn't actually kill him, and I don't think Mommy Longlegs actually killed him. Catnap is worshipping this shrine that he has made, uh, his creation of the prototype. Uh, he sort of built his own. Uh, we saw an image of this, a screenshot of this, in some of the uh, pre-release uh, info uh, when uh, when it didn't come out uh, in December. And yeah, you can see here we've got like some of the pals. We've got um, this is Car uh, Candy Cat. We got oh look at this. There's a piece of Boxy Boo here. That's his box, and those are his feet right there. Uh, and that's his mouth. Yeah, just pieces of him everywhere. Uh, Bobby Bear hug. She's there. We got a we've got a huggy wuggy doll, um, kicking chicken, crafty corn. I mean, they're all here. And and also, actually, there's two. So PJ Pugapillar could still be alive. These are like little mini ones. They aren't the bigger ones. Uh, he is smaller because there's one here, and then there's one down there as well. Um, but I feel like uh, Catnap is making this shrine as one that's accurate to the prototype which would have PJ Pugapillar in it and and the reason you can see he's really trying to make it the prototype is not only is there the Huggy doll um, is this right here this is the hand the claw that we constantly see um, we can we can watch Catnap from here from the shrine's perspective and, uh, and and see what he does here oh does he just stand there yeah he, he ain't gonna move I think when we move he moves. Uh, oh, nope, he despawned. There he goes. Okay. Now, oh yeah, I think I have to shoot you. <laughs> yeah, so I was gonna say, oh, let's see where he goes. Whoa, we have to do this whole thing. Why? Wow, like, now that I'm doing this again, like, I've forgotten how long this game is. This is the dog day chase, right? Yeah. Now, I mean, we don't really need to, like, have a look at him that much because we actually get a really good, like, you can get right up close to him. Alright. Yeah. Okay. I will. Good idea. Let's go. Oh, okay. Now, um, a lot of people were terrified by this, but it's not that scary. Cause look, I can pause him and then like turn around. See, there he is. It's not so scary. What is the back of him? Oh, okay. Don't burp on me. That's gross, man. Oh, look. Oh yeah. So that is his body. I was thinking, oh, they didn't put the back legs on. Well, they, yeah, that's true. Because, well, he doesn't have back legs. He was he was just a front of his body, dragging himself through the pipes. Here we go. Here he comes. Yes, there we go. Yeah, see, it's not scary. I'm, like, making weird sounds and stuff. Okay, okay, right here we want to pause. Okay, just a sec. <laughs> I know. But I want to see, because I went down this tunnel here, I want to see what happens if you go down the left tunnel and the right tunnel, which, uh, wait, is, hold on, can you? Oh, here we go. Okay, so we're going to try and go down this slide. Does it take you to the same place or is it different? It looks the same. Well, okay, look, so it looks like that, right? And then... Is there another slide here? So if we go through here, wait, what? All right, let's look at, so it's, yeah, this looks the same, but let's get back out there and then let's try, shut up. Um, let's try this one. Cause I went, uh, I went down this one cause it had happy faces and stuff. What is this actually? Oh no, it is different. Look at that. So this is the one I came down. It is different. Just a straight path. 
Like that. This is the middle one. Okay. Yep. And then the right hand one. Do they all work though? So the right hand one goes this way. Then it goes down here. Like, is there one that's wrong? Uh, this one could be wrong. Because it puts you off here. And then... Oh no, I think they all... They all end up, yeah, they all end up going to a door. So we're going to choose a different one. I'm going to choose this one. I like this one the most. This one looks the scariest. Uh, just because like, ready, ready, here we go. And three, two, one, go. Okay. So we're going to go down this one. And then we got to keep going and you got to duck and you got to duck here. But I don't think he's actually chasing us anymore. And it takes you here where they all, oh, right. I forgot. <laughs> we're almost there and pause. Let's see how he looks. He's, uh, he's not that close here. He's just crawling around. Okay, I'm sorry. I had the wrong hand on, so I could die here. Because I was too busy thinking about pausing. Oh, no. I definitely screwed up. <laughs> <laughs> I was, like, outside my camera and everything. All right, let me just, uh, let me, let me do that again. Sorry about that. Oh, no, it put me through anyway. Some, or what, some, oh, okay, well. Uh, can I, can I like, thank you, <laughs> thank you, that's much better, ah, okay, so, yeah, he, I guess, like, I had gotten, he's obviously not there because of, we saw, he wasn't there, we were there, oh, right, right, oh, I got him, <laughs> I knew you were coming in, bro, look at him, he's about to grab poor Bunzo right there, nah, -uh, bro, wait, let's get some light on him, like, he's, there we go, yeah, look how happy he is, to grab that. Let's back off and watch what he does here with Bunzo. Boom. And he jumps! I, I don't know where he jumped. Okay. I, I need to know what this is here. Uh, let's see. Let's go... Th is there anything here? Nah. There's nothing. So I heard this. Oh, nah. Through the wall here, there's nothing. Like, I wondered who was playing this music. I need to know! <laughs> I don't know what that is! Okay, right. Oh, I forgot! This is the dream sequence! This game is unbelievably long! Now I can? What? Oh! Oh my goodness! I forgot about that part! Holy cow, that scared me! Okay, dream sequence! Right? I can't believe there's this much still in the game. So now, right, so, I mean, I, I definitely, yeah, let's see what it can, actually, let's just, let's just jump out and see what it'll let us do. Uh, it's, oh, wow, it does not like this. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get back in, because I, I don't know what, yeah, you can't really explore anything here, can I? I no, I can't move. It's like a cutscene. I'm, I'm not, a, I can't move out of the camera. Ah, uh, I mean, you can move the camera, but like this is almost a static scene. It's really cool, though. Okay, pause it. I can pause it. Can I use the camera? Please tell me. <gasps> yes! This is what I was hoping for in the dream sequence. We can also do it against a uh, catnap. But as you can see, and it, the frame rate isn't great for whatever reason, we only see the arm. There's nothing else. You go beyond it, and it's gone. And we can turn back around. We can look from its, like, yep, it just ends right there. Wow, this is crazy. Look at that. Although I, I might say... Do we see more of the arm than we've ever seen? We might be seeing more detail of the arm than we've ever seen. I don't know whose part this is from that it's created. Uh, there are bones here. But, uh, yeah. There we go. There's the arm. Look at it go. <laughs> Alright, I'll put it back. <gasps> yes! That worked out great! Alright, and... There we go. Cool. Yes. Alright, um... So we get to see his smoke there. And what's he doing? He just he's just coming up to his full size there, right? Yeah. Should I let it like come and kill me? Yeah, we could. Oh yeah, I'm over there, so we can actually get a good view like this. 
and just watch him come in and kill me. Oh my goodness, look at him. Yeah, so this is a different face. Now he's looking at me because that's like where the camera is, even though like the player arms are here and he's actually walking toward that to kill. But there, let's get a look from, let's get a look from behind. Oh, 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 oh. Let's not look up there. <laughs> Look at him all like bony and scaly. He's definitely changed. He's got sores on his body uh, He looks very different than we've seen him uh, Throughout we just I never really got this really close-up look of him and look at his tongue, too It's like a metallic tongue. He is definitely transformed uh, Let's see it. Let's watch him kill us. Well, there he goes um, 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 He ate us. Okay so let's get back into our body and uh, let's get through this boss fight and there's actually a little bit more Well, obviously we want to see the prototypes hand again see where that comes from uh, when he is uh, taking out catnap Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah here come on jump up. Yeah time to pause time to have a look Let's see how he climbs. Does he actually touch it? I want to yeah, they are actually uh... Oh Hi Holy freaky dude, man. Jeez. Okay. That is crazy. Look at him. So this is actually, we can actually play it. He's still looking at us. Uh, because I don't think I, I can do anything here. I don't think I need to do anything here. Right. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I, I broke the sound. Okay. All right. Get back in. <laughs> oh, no. I think I'm supposed to be up there. <laughs> Help! All right, here we go. Here we go. All right, this is what I wanted actually. So I want to like when he. Yep. Okay, that's what I wanted to do, and sort of like go look while he's up here. I know I shouldn't be messing with a boss fight like this, but this is too much of a cool opportunity. If I die, it's worth it. Oh my goodness, yo, that is <laughs> that's so scary. Okay, wait. Let's see if his whole body is formed or. If it's just yeah, look at that. He looks like a spider from the back too. So I actually didn't expect his whole body to be there because you can only see his face, but they actually modeled the whole thing. His tail does go out the back a little bit here. But yes, that is cool. Oh look, there's like another one up here. I wonder what Yeah, what's he? What's he about? Okay, so now I've gotta like Okay, I gotta I hope holding down the button again. Uh, I might die here. Ready? Y yep, I'm gonna die. No, wait, I got it back. Woo! Let's go. <laughs> I thought that it, yeah, cause it like yeah. Okay, we're still good. All right, that that was cool. That was worth it. Even if I had died there, that would have been worth it, in my opinion. Hold on, we just gotta check. Is this? Cause I'm worried he's gonna come toward. Okay, there we go. Final slot. You just gotta watch, cause sometimes he turns in right there. And then, okay, all right, we got it. I'm gonna hold this thing shut, bro. Nope. Goodbye. Man, sometimes when you play this, he doesn't he doesn't open it once, and then other times, once he's opened it, man, he loves that attack. All right, there we go. And pause. <laughs> all right. Uh, this might. Oh, 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 oh no, we're breaking it. All right, let's 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 actually get back to it because the sound is not synced right I guess to, to What's about to happen here and like not that we could really like see anything super special anyway But this part right here is where we want to get into it. All right, all right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go Bop. All right, we got a prototype. Let's see what it's connected to poor old catnap here is uh, okay and, and don't worry about the sounds we should still get the animation here, but we want to see it is no, it's still disconnected. Ah. <laughs> so uh, I was hoping we might see more of the prototype, but they're never going to let us see it until until they want us to. They know that people like me are going to hack through this game and look for pieces like this and never let us find them. But we could watch from his perspective here and uh, and, and sort of like step through it a little bit here. Yep. Okay. Oh, look, look, look. It's so cool. Now, does it come down further to get him, or does he stand up? I can't remember. Let's watch from this angle here, like up higher, I guess, just so we can really see. Does he stand up? Yeah, he does stand up. So the the prototype doesn't come any lower out of the vent, which which it makes sense, right? Because 
uh, they don't really want us seeing much more of it, right? Uh, no matter what the perspective. Uh, we, he's still got this on his back. That's weird. And we wouldn't see that from the player's perspective down there. All right, and then he stands up. He looks at him. Oh, and then the figures come straight out. And, and this is like him sort of like praying to him. Or, or, or accepting the prototype that it's going to save him, but, uh, as we know, oh, look at that, <laughs> oh, that's, that, that, that goes straight, now, does it go through the back of him, oh, yeah, look, yeah, you can, you can actually see the claw right through the back of him, right there, we can see them. Oh, that is nuts, what a split screen, like a, a screenshot, uh, and then, Oh, yeah, okay, all right, all right, yep. Oh, I didn't notice all of that. Now, what I want to see is, does the light go out in his eyes? Because obviously we know he's dead. He goes limp here. Oh, and that, yeah, I didn't even, I didn't even know, I mean, we should have noticed with the, uh, the, the prototype's animation uh, that the hand does pull him up. Well, <laughs> through his head, yikes. Now, the prototype is actually, it's moved. So that part of it, I think, yeah, is almost going into the sidewall here uh, because of uh, the way the animation has to go for him. All right, let's 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 see. Aww. Okay, now where does he take him? That's what we want to know now. We got to step through this. Okay, he's lifting him through. Now, how much? Oh, yeah. So the prototype. Now, do we think he's going to pull him into here? I mean, obviously, this is going to despawn once we can't see it anymore. But let's see how high up he pulls it right here. Whoa, he comes way up, dude. I thought it would have... Well, I guess we have to wait until his legs disappear before it despawns. So it's going to pull him pretty far up into this. Further than I expected. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. And then all the lighting dies and... Uh, it just disappears into well actually the prototype has gone out of the map here. Oh, it's still here though Look look look. It's actually still here. The mesh is still there or the model. Yeah, we can see it Yeah, dragging him out uh, through this vent here and then Wow Wow, it stayed so much longer now as the player Can we oh yeah, we can still see his legs here, but then yeah, there it goes. Okay. There it is. Yay, we get back up, <laughs> and our hand is gone. Yeah, but we actually, like, we get it back <laughs> somehow. I mean, it's, like, in our inventory somehow, but, uh, yeah, okay. So, there's actually, and, and this is why I wanted you guys to watch it first. All right, so this, like, uh, scene here with the Hour of Joy and Poppy's speech is uh, the most cinematic part of the game, the vocal performance, I still can't get over of Poppy. I've listened to it like 10 times. I absolutely love it. I don't know why I'm even saying it because if you're if you're this far through the video, you didn't listen to me anyway. Uh, <laughs> this is why I wanted you to be sure that you watch it first because I'm going to absolutely ruin the cutscene here because Good. You're here. so she's in the vent, but I, I, I you can <laughs> ride this to the top. So we'll ride this to the top. Here it goes. They uh, didn't put an invisible wall over this. <laughs> so you can actually ride this up. She's going to come out right there. There she is. Now, uh, yeah, she's going to show us the hour of joy. But in the meantime, while she does that, I think, yeah! The staircase! I made it! So they block off this staircase. You can't get up or down it. Um, well, I don't want to go there because it might actually make me uh, go away. But look, we can explore this whole area here. So that's the Hour of Joy. Uh, it shows on that TV. Uh, and and it's horrifying. Absolutely horrifying. But what is up here? Whoa, they made this. Ooh, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? We got anything? That's empty. I, I don't even need to go in there to see it. Um, oh man, oh this is just a little, and that just goes to the other room, that's it! I wanted to get up here so bad before, but there's really like, <laughs> it's not great. And I'm not using like any of the, the hack tool that I'm using. That This is literally as a player, you can do this. Uh, and again, it ruins this emotional scene, this reveal, uh, completely and entirely. Ah, oh, man, that's a letdown. I, I wish I could get up there where Poppy is, but you can't get over these railings. Um, I mean, I could, like, 
I could like, well, I could fly over to her and hang out for her. Oh, she she looks sleepy. Uh, it's it's she looks sleepy. It's kind of like my end emoji. She's actually supposed to be looking down at us. Yeah. When I look down, it makes me look sleepy. Anyway, uh, I need to get off of this. Can I just? Yeah, there we go. Okay, cool. Right. So, um, as you guys can, you guys know. Ah, here we go. So it's pulling us back up to her for this. And ah, oh, man. Like I, I, this part, this gives me chills. This this speech here. I remember hearing every moment. Oh, that's so good. It went on so long. Agonizingly long. I tried to hide, to run, anything to stay alive. I remember their cries. Chills. What's uh. going on? Why is this happening? What are those things? <laughs> Senseless slaughter. That's all it really was. They killed everyone. Guilty, the innocent, didn't matter. All of that death didn't fix anything. And then, once it was all over, they dragged those corpses down below where they'd never be found. And they ate the bodies to stay alive. Okay, she just pops there. And I just, Ellen I couldn't. Has to die for this, for everything. I couldn't like I couldn't bring myself to pause it during her speech because it's just too good. I didn't like the timing. Everything about that speech is perfect. I wish I could voice act like that. All right, so uh, we, as you know, if you've watched the the video, uh, we go down this lift, and uh, because she activates the handle, well, once we get on it, um, she uh, this will start to go down, and we don't know what happens to her. But we can actually find out what happens to her without me using the camera. I think that you can do it as a player if you're quick. Oh, come on. All right. All right. Once well, the ground, you can do it, cautious. but I'm going to do it this way. I did it before. Okay, so we hear the noise. Here we go. What's happening? What's happening? The kissy Missy. No. She's faking. <laughs> so yeah, no matter what, whether you get the camera or 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 uh, or if you get out as the player, uh, no matter what, Kissy Missy does absolutely nothing. She's faking. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Something is definitely happening there. They just didn't uh, animate it because, well, they don't want us to see it. People like me hacking through the game would be able to see what actually happened because they knew I would do this. So they just don't show us anything and they leave it up to our imagination and a cliffhanger for Poppy Playtime Chapter 4. <laughs>